change things just for the sake of... Hey everybody, changing. Jimmy Hutchison here with another video about the Honda Transalp XL750. So I decided to purchase the um, Rhino saddlebags. It's the Rackless saddlebags. I got the large, I think they're 14 litres each side. So that's 28 litres in total. And um, I've put them on the bike. They're on the back there. I'll give you a little walk around and show you what I think of them and how I installed them, what I think, how they look on the bike and a little bit like that. So let's have a quick look. Rhino walk. So here's the bags. These are the Rhino walk on the trans out. I'll give you a little overview of what they look like from behind quickly. I'll do a little bit of talking about them. So with these bags here on the trans out, um, I'm gonna carry my my bedroll, my sleeping bag, my pillows, some clothes, some snacks, and um, maybe a bit of a first aid kit and whatever I need. I'm gonna put the heavy stuff towards the bottom. But these are the bags I've been looking at. They're Rackless, they're from Rhino Walk. And um, I went the Rackless way because I didn't want to have permanent bags on all the time. These I can throw on and take off and just ride the bike normally. And um, I also think it looks better Plus it's soft, when you drop the bike, it'll not be as aggressive of damage. What I'll do is I'll show you how I mounted the bags, which was a bit of a pain in the bum. It was very fiddly. It took about two or three hours of strapping up different locations. And I finally got somewhere where the bags not really moving. So these are the bags. I open this one up quickly. And I'll show you on the other side how I mounted it. As you can see in there, got a pillow, sleeping bag. It sort of, it sort of drops down and angles back, as you can see there. Pretty easy to get inside. Nice rubbery material. It's got one of them little bars across there so you can roll it up. It's got two snaps across there, straps. Um, bit of reflective stuff on it. So how it's strapped, it's got a strap there with a buckle. And it's strapped to the back of here. And a strap there, strap there. Just a bit of an elastic that you can tidy all that straps up. Um, just to get it mounting right on the back and sitting nice, I'm using one of the straps that locks the bag just to pull it up a little bit more because it's not a perfect fit at all. But it'll, it'll do, as you can see, it's sort of there like that. And then there's another one on buckles with a strap that goes around there to the buckle, pull that tight, tie it up. I'm just showing this one. Strap there. Strap there. Another strap there. This one's just got my my hiking mat. Sea to summit. Self inflating. And um, pretty straightforward. Pretty straightforward. Sorry about moving the camera. Thank you. 